Hello guys, welcome to Mr. Legend Crypto. Guys, in this video, we'll be taking a look at an altcoin, Credo, currently trading for $0.1. Right now, we're deep in the crypto bear market. Credo has lost more than 98.3% of its value in the last one year. But guys, that's not just peculiar to Credo. A lot of altcoins are down really bad. That's what happens in the crypto bear market. But after the bear market comes the bull run. And if you want to be profitable by the end of the next bull run, you have to be willing to accumulate in the crypto bear market. As we're getting some credo right now in the crypto bear market, can we go any lower? Where are important levels to pay attention to for credo in the crypto bear market? In this video, we'll be looking at the credo US dollar price chart on a 3 day time frame. We'll also be looking at credo's performance against Bitcoin, credo's performance against Ethereum, and we'll also take a look at credo's market cap. Currently, it has a market cap of $23 million. How high can the market cap go if we catch a relief rally in the altcoin market? If we keep jumping to Goblin Town, how low can Credo's market cap go? We'll be talking about that and more in this video. But first, guys, when it comes to investing, nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. And investment in knowledge pays the best interest. So if you want to make money long-term trading or investing in cryptocurrencies, if you want to get the latest crypto news, price predictions, and chart analysis, this is the channel for you. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Let's get down to business. One, two, Guys, all coins are down bad in the crypto bear market, Credo included. Credo has lost more than 98% of its value in the last one year. But we can see that other all coins have done the same thing. We have Falcon down 92% in the last one year. Axie Infinity down 93%. Engine Coin down 90%. Mana down 91%. Solana down 93%. The story of the altcoin market is the bear market has been brutal to altcoins. Even the king of the altcoins, Ethereum, is down more than 70% in the last one year. This is a Credo US dollar price chart. Credo is going through its first crypto bear market. We saw this altcoin pump from the 19th of September 2021 at the $0.76 level. Credo went up more than 1,100% in just 63 days, pumping to as high as $9.66. But after Credo topped on the 21st of November 2021, it has been dumping to Goblin Town. From an all-time high of $9.66, Credo has gotten to an all-time low of $0.1, going down more than 98.8% in the last one year. But guys, all coins are very, very volatile that way. The bear market sees them dumping to Goblin Town. But if you're getting ready for the next bull run, if you're accumulating some Credo for when to go back to new all-time highs, the best time to do that is in the crypto bear market. Yes, Credo might not have bottom in the bear market. There's always a possibility we'll see Credo dumping to lower prices. But guys, we're closer to the bottom than we are to the top. And if you want to be among the next millionaires that will be shouting to the moon by the end of the next bull run, right now in the bear market is where you want to be accumulating. When the crypto market is in extreme fear is when you want to be getting your favorite altcoins. From where Credo is currently trading right now, for Credo to go back to new all-time highs, we'll have to see this altcoin pump more than 8,700%, which means $1,000 invested in Credo right now, if Credo is going back to the previous all-time high we set in November 2021, that $1,000 will be worth over $87,000. Now, these are key levels for you to pay attention to for Credo in the bear market. The bottom might not be in, but these are important levels where Credo might be reacting to as we continue going through the crypto bear market. The first level will be the $0.19 level. We saw Credo spend quite a number of weeks right there. We thought the bottom was in since September 2022. Credo was holding the $0.19 level. We finally broke below that level on the 6th of November 2022, so I'll not be shocked to see Credo. Pump back to that level, maybe we'll get rejected, maybe we'll pump to higher prices. Another level I'll pay close attention to for Credo will be around the $0.37 region. If Credo starts getting above this level, maybe just maybe the bottom will be in. The key level to pay attention to right now for Credo, the most critical level in the bear market is the $0.1 level. That's acting as our bear market bottom. Yes, Credo can go lower than that, but right now, that's the lowest we have seen Credo trade, and that will be acting as our bear market bottom. If you take a look at what Credo has done in the last one year, this altcoin has a market cap of $23.5 million, a fully directed market cap of $217 million, and in the last one year, it has gone from as high as $8.39 to as low as $0.1. Over 216 million Credo tokens are in circulation out of a maximum 2 billion tokens. Currently ranked 499 on coin market cap, Credo has over 49,000 people that have this altcoin on their watch list. 
Now, what is Credo Network? Credo is rearchitecting digital asset ownership and blockchain connectivity, a radical new approach to bringing liquidity and capital efficiency to the blockchain economy. Credo has pioneered the first centralized, trustless, multi party computational custodian network. These advancements enable Credo to offer decentralized custody, native cross chain swaps, and cross platform liquidity assets. Where can you get some Credo if you want to get some of the bear market? Getting ready for the next bull run. If you believe we're going to see Credo pumping to new all time highs, going above the $1 level, the $2 level, even going above the $9 level we got to in 2021, guys, you want to be buying those Credos in the bear market. And if you want to get Credo, you can get it on Qcoin, on Bitfinex, on Gemini, on Uniswap, on Gate.io, on Wobi. And I'm sure it will be coming to Binance very, very soon. You can get it on all your popular crypto exchanges. If you take a look at Credo's performance against Bitcoin, we have seen this all coin set new all-time lows in the bear market. And that's music to your ear. If you're one of those long-term investors that want to be buying all coins on the cheap, when you hear new all-time lows, that's when you want to be dollar cost averaging. That's when you want to be accumulating, getting ready for the next bull run. A little warning, guys, if you're buying it all coins, you don't want to go all in. Yes, we love them when they're pumping to the moon. In the bull run, we saw Credo go up over 892% against Bitcoin. Don't forget, in the bear market, they continue dumping to Goblin Town. You saw Credo lose more than 96% of its value against Bitcoin in less than a year. I'll not be shocked to see Credo continue dumping to Goblin Town, but if you're dollar cost averaging into it and buying as setting your all-time lows at some point in time by the end of the next bull run, you will be happy you accumulated through the bear market of 2022. Now, if you take a look at Credo's performance against Ethereum, we have also set new all-time lows in the bear market. After Credo outperformed Ethereum in the bull run in 107 days, we saw Credo pumping more than 800%. Right now, Credo has been dumping to Goblin Town and it has lost more than 95% of its value in around one year against Ethereum. Will you set new all-time lows in the bear market? There's always a possibility, but I'll also not be shocked to see Credo pumping against both Bitcoin and Ethereum as we enter 2023. Guys, when the market is in extreme fear, when all hope looks to be lost, that's when the market will just surprise everybody and start pumping. So I'll not be shocked to see us entry 2023 with a huge pump to the upside for all coins. We've well, been seeing some all coins pump on the monthly time frame and on the weekly time frame. And I believe when Credo starts pumping, we'll see it pump to higher prices. Now, take a look at Credo's market cap. We've seen Credo's market cap go from as high as $328 million, dropping to as low as $20 million in the bear market. Credo's market cap can set new all-time lows, but right now, the all-time low for Credo's market cap is around that $20 million region. Maybe just maybe we'll see it go below $20 million, but by the end of the next bull run, I'll not be shocked to see Credo's market cap going above a billion dollars. That's very, very possible. Guys, all coins are very, very volatile that way. And according to the Fibonacci Retracement tool, Credo's market cap has the ability to even get $1.2 billion. So guys, drop your thoughts in the comment section. Are you buying more Credo right now in the bear market? Do you think the bottom is in for Credo in the crypto bear market? If you think the bottom is not in, how low do you think Credo can possibly go from our currency trading right now? Will you be holding some Credo to the end of the next bull run? Drop your thoughts about that in the comment section. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Turn on the post notification if you want to get notified anytime I drop a new video. See you guys in my next video.